Hi, I'm Robert Irvine. I am Nelson Aguilar, and you're here with Bites with Birds. And today we're going to show you how to cook fish correctly, but in specifically striped bass with roasted vegetables and a pistachio kind of salsa mm. or pesto. All right, striped bass. This is what it looks like. It's not like sea bass. Sea bass is a big, fat fish, right? And its original name of sea bass was what? Sea bass? Nope. The Alaskan toothfish. But it didn't sound too sexy, so we named it sea bass. Now we, now we sell a lot of it. Toothfish to yeah. sea bass. I didn't even get that. Like, Nor did I. But somebody did, because they made a lot of money on it. All right, striped bass. All we've done is filleted the striped bass, and to stop it sizzling up in a pan and becoming curly fish, I'm going to take the knife and literally draw back the knife and slit holes in the fish, like so. Airways? Because if I put the pan on, it gets hot, and the fish is not scored like this, all it will do, it'll curl up like this. Mm. Because the skin becomes tight, and it's no good. All right, on with the pan, get it nice and hot. This is gonna be a really fast dish. So, what I want you to do is take cucumber, and I want you to just grate the cucumber, like this, into the bowl. Let's do it. I can do that. All right, tzatziki sauce, or something like that. Meanwhile, while you're doing that, I'm just gonna chop up some mint. Get rid of the mint. Into a pan or a bowl. We've got pistachio nuts, a little bit of cheese, some olive oil, and a little bit of vinegar. And because it's fish, we're gonna take some citrus. Let me clean this away and I have a question for you. I'm full of questions. It's really because I'm nosy. <laughs> what team do you like to play the most mm. in the league to go against? They got a couple. I think, uh, honestly, I like some of our division opponents. In our division, I would have to say the Redskins. Okay. Uh, and then I would say, I like to go against my hometown team, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Oh, the Buccaneers. Yeah. yeah. Who do you like to niggle the most when you play, player-wise? Who do you like, like, get in the face a little bit and, like, taunt them? Uh, honestly, like, I don't, have, I don't have a player, but I'm the little guy that loves to talk trash to the D linemen. I love going up to the D linemen and telling them, hey, man, stay off my quarterback. Or you better watch yourself before I trick. I'm a, you know, I'm Give a block. Give me an attitude. You. Give me like like, 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 let's say you're like a big D lineman. What do you mean, I, like a big? I am a big guy. Eh, okay. Close, close. Okay. So okay. I go up to a D lineman and I just I mean, bump him. I'm like, hey, 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 little guy, watch yourself. Knowing that I'll probably get like punished into the ground, but I just walk away like, hey, you, hey, you better walk away. But I'm the one walking away. So you give him attitude. A lot of attitude. So like, yeah, yeah. Just get away like from that. my. But QB. If you, if, yeah, yeah, it's like, hey, hey, Ow. hey, hey, stay, hey, hey, stay off 11, man, and walk away. Like that. I like this. I like it. I, I tell you, I could get into this game. Like, really. If I was fast enough, if I was fit enough, I was big enough. So far, I'm none of the above. <laughs> All right, I need more than that. All right, so the key to this is make sure that you push down. All that goes in there. Whew. I know, I was fast. I look like a rookie, don't I? <laughs> he did right, that. See, my pan is smoking. Now watch this. This is like magic. Skin side down. I put the oil at the end so it doesn't splash anywhere. And then gently bring the oil back in to the fish. This cooks really, really fast. See how it's starting to puff up now? Just mix that with a spoon. I'm going to add a little arugula, which is nice and peppery, into that pistachio mix. Notice I'm not touching the fish, just mixing this up nicely. I don't want salt in this because I want the peppery uh, taste from it. That's almost ready. Clean this, clean your station, please. Cleansiness is just second to godliness? Close. Cleanliness is next to godliness. I'm going to say second because I think God's first. Oh, you're... that's <laughs> what I just said. Look. <laughs> the fish 
fish gets turned over. Yeah. See how fast it is cooking? Yeah. Now, in that pan, you've got to put a little bit of oil, turn it on. Tomatoes, cauliflower. Why do they call this cauliflower if it has no color? Cauliflower. Choufleur. Souffleur? Choufleur, that's French, you know. You know French? Look. Uh, bleu blanc? Bleu blanc. Bleu blanc. That's it. That's bleu blanc. You, that's you go. Now look, again, a little bit of butter. Butter. I'm going to take a little bit of my fish oil. It's nice and hot. I turn the heat off. The fish is already beautifully cooked. All right, our plate. I'm going to plate. Do you like a lot of fish? Do you eat a lot of fish? I do. What is your favorite fish? Uh, I would have to say a miso glazed salmon. Oh, you're very specific. Yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> miso glazed. Okay. So basically, you've got sour cream and cucumber that you've just shredded. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, a little bit of acid. Mix, mix, mix. Now, I'm going to teach you something that took me 25 years and probably $250 million to learn. I'm going to give it to you for free. Let me hear it. This is how you set a plate up for service. Watch. Like so. Now look, that was easy. That's it. That's it? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Ooh. That's it right there. That's a $250 million movement. It's a smear, right? Then. Couple more seconds. I'm gonna take my spoon. Look at this fish. Mm. Vegetables are ready. I'm a spoon guy. I prefer spoons to tongs. I think I'm gonna be a spoon guy after this too. I, I just think it's easier to control. Vegetables. Just turn that heat up on me. Thank you. Then we're gonna take a couple of pieces of fish. Mm. Presentation is everything. Well, you know, I, I think to me, food is we're actually giving something to somebody from here. You know how you play? You talk about passion. When you cook for somebody, it's like giving a piece of yourself to somebody. It really is. It's, it's very special to me. So I like to make sure that we take our time and not throw things on the plate. All right, a little salad, that's our pistachio, a little cheese. So there you have it, striped bass, pan-seared, roasted vegetable, tzatziki sauce, and a little arugula. I'm Robert Irvine. I'm Nelson Aguilar, and this has been Bites with Birds. See you next time.